today we're going to be going over how to complete the heaviest of hearts gig in cyberpunk 2077 completely stealth and we're going to be doing it without using any insane skills because if you could just go invisible for the whole time that's not really that hard so here's how you're going to want to do it first off go to the heaviest of hearts club and don't fire your gun because that's anti-stealth talk to the bartender instead ask them where georgina zimbrinsky is she's going to point you to this guy talk to this guy he's going to point you to this door go to this door you're going to see a schmuck getting kicked out you could talk to the dude but none of these conversations actually mattered i just wanted to lead you through a bit of the prologue if you're interested in that what you're really gonna wanna do is go through this door right here. Make sure the security guard doesn't see you because stealth involves the security guards not seeing you. At this point, there's a camera right here off to my left. You are going to need to avoid the camera and run the route that I'm showing here. To avoid the camera, you can use a sand devastand, you can hack the camera, you can go invisible, you can even just dash past it. You're gonna need one of these skills, but any of them should work. And if you have none of these skills, you really jumped ahead in the whole cyberpunk 2077 quest line didn't you anyways take that guard out that's sitting at the seat and now you should have free access to this computer go to the local network turn off the surveillance system and now things got a whole lot easier because security cameras give security and turning them off helps you probably should have figured that out but hey some of you have a lower iq than the number of digits on my hands so let's keep going go up the stairs hit subscribe notice how i snuck that in there but it does help the channel anyways there's gonna be a guy over here to your right i chose to grab him and throw him into this fridge because i'm a little bit mean anyways once you get past that you're gonna be out into this lounge area and despite all the patrons being passed out the guards all still have laser-like abilities to spot you. So run over to this booth and hug it like it's your high school girlfriend. Now what you're going to want to do is you're going to see this door, open that door, duck back behind this booth. Once that sort of like eye thing, that red eye thing is down, go through the door, close the door. Once you're done talking with the boys, you head back out into this hostile hellhole. So now you're going to hug this booth, you're going to just run right across, sort of straight down this path, you're going to see me do it here. And while I'm doing this and trying not to get caught, I'm going to ask you again, could you please hit subscribe? I try to make these guides as short and sweet as possible every now and then. I have areas like this where I don't really have anything to say, so I get to give a little bit of a pitch. But otherwise, I try not to waste time, I just show you the path to take and get done with it. Anyways, now this guard here, somehow he's not going to notice the fact that you sneak right next to him through this door. He's a bit stupid, maybe he had a bit too much to drink, I don't know. Get through him, close the door, and now you should be good. This guard over here, however, is not so good. He's in a hard place to get, so you gotta climb on top of some boxes, really just sort of eke your way in there, grab him, knock him out, and then go through the door that he was not so good at guarding. There's gonna be another guard over here to your left. Guess what you're gonna wanna do? Yep, you figured it out. What he was guarding tends to be a fuse box. And what you're gonna wanna do is override this fuse box and it's gonna reveal a secret door. This door you can go through and now you're going to find the VIP, Georgina something another, I forgot the name, who cares? You're gonna go talk to her. And that's gonna be the end of this quest, but some of you have an IQ that's probably similar to mine and you won't know that this thing exists right here. Flip it, you're gonna open this door Go to your right, you're gonna go down some stairs and bing, bang, boom, and just like that, you completed the heaviest of hearts gig without ever firing off your gun. Until next time, peace.